What is good, world? Everyone's having a great day. Being productive and getting straight to it. This video is going to be three exercises that I do to build solid core strength and to build more power in my core. I got this exercise from Constantine at the top right. You can see his name. One of the best, I believe, the greatest deadlifter ever. I've seen this man deadlift 900 pounds. Um, I think it was like 939 in the competition. He did not wear a belt. He did it um, conventional. So I started doing this exercise and it builds my core strength crazy. I'm talking about you will be confident to not deadlift with a belt. So give this exercise a try. It's going to build a lot of core strength. And also it's going to be beneficial if you round your back. As you can see right here, it's going to strengthen those muscles. So it's going to be an injury prevention. A strong core is a injury prevention machine. It's going to help you brace more. It's going to be able to help you lift more. So right here, we are going to do dumbbell crunches. I am not 100% on my lower back. I'm getting there. So I, instead of doing 180, I'm going to do 150 for a few reps. And I got this exercise from Andre, another Russian who was great at lifting. He's one of the GOATs as well. He's won a lot of competitions. Um, this guy is just on another level. So I happen to look at his exercises. And for core, he emphasized doing this. I just seen him do this. And it is a game changer. So what you want to do is get a dumbbell, put your hands under, and you just want to to be conscious i put the weights on my feet so i don't have to have anybody hold me down so i'll be able to do it properly so what i do is as well i put a pad in my lower back so i'm not putting a lot of stress on my back to get injured so you could do it without a pad or with a pad i'm doing it with a pad and that's the way i'm going to do it and right here um this is not 150 pounds right here this is actually 100 pounds and i believe yeah, it's 100 pounds, so doing it for a couple reps, pretty much like a burnout set. And what, what you want to do is just have a, a top set that you do, and then you want to do a lot of um, lightweight for high volume. You want to build a lot of work capacity, so whenever you do lift, you'll be able to not get injured. So give this a shot. I'm pretty sure you're going to get a lot of benefits during dumbbell crunches. Also, I meant to do like um, a workout for my oblique. So I do basically three different sizes for core. It's going to be basically uh, a way to work out the upper and mid, which is going to be crunches. Um, anything that's going to help the hip flexors and lower abs so that's going to help the number two and number three is going to be obliques i didn't do obliques in this but right here i'm going to show you the lower part of the abs that's going to hit the hip flexors and this is reverse squats reverse squats is basically doing any type of lift where you're lifting your leg up and this is going to help build solid core strength in your lower section of your abs and also it's going to hit your hip flexors hip flexors are great to increase because it's going to increase hip power it's going to be the main mover to lift your legs up so give this workout a try i'm pretty sure you'll be a more explosive lifter a better athlete and also great at injury prevention so this is the end of the video like comment subscribe let's be great let's stay motivated